Okay guys, so today I'm gonna to teach you how to put hood pins on your 2015 through 17 Mustangs. Let's get it. As much as I like being modded, it would be nice if you would stop putting holes in me. It does hurt, you know. Okay, so realistically, there are no videos that show anybody how to do this. This is very simple, this is very easy. I'm not a professional mechanic at all, and I've already installed the one the other day just to try to see if I can actually get it to work, because I kind of figured it would be a fail. However, it worked, so now I'm gonna teach you guys how I did it, how you can do it, and how you can actually get hood pins on this car with the style of hood that it has. Very clean cut there. Okay, so the tools you're going to need for this is going to be a drill. Me, I like to go big or go home, so I have this oversized thing, which is not necessary, but you need some form of wrench. A screwdriver. You need a small and a large step up drill bit. And another tool that I just now remembered, an eight millimeter socket. Now this is gonna to have to go right in there. It's actually gonna end up sitting back a little bit further. Son of a bitch, I said it hurts. level at all times, which it's already showing that it isn't. Next step is I'm gonna take this uh, toothpaste, put it right on the top. This way it'll transfer and I can see where I can make my cut into the hood. I find it funny that you're using toothpaste when I have teeth. Okay, and you can see the toothpaste is right there. I'm gonna show you why we're gonna to start to open this up before coming all the way through to the top. This is basically so that way you don't accidentally screw up all right so now that we have a circular hole no sh it's circular it's not a square I'm going to bring it back down test fit it just stick your hand back here you can feel that's actually dead center seems pretty good I'm also going to go up here open it up this way this is bullshit. I look like crap. How dare you put me on camera without washing me? You want me to be faster than Hot Wheels. Yet you never listen to Gregory Salvatore and take the first damn step to wash me. Alright. So we're getting a little bit of rubbing right there in this bottom section. I'm gonna go ahead and open this side up a little bit more.
so now we're ready to put the other piece on okay so if you look at your hood pin stick something in it you'll notice there's an angle so this angle is actually going to want to go in this opposite direction right here so that way it can go up with the line of the hood trying to tighten this right there just like this using my overkill wrench now we have these four screws here that are self tapping Make sure everything lines up. I'm just gonna place that right there. Some pressure try not to slip because if you slip you're really gonna mess your hood up now let the record show mine as of right now, it's actually a daily driver. My hood already has a few uh, scratches in it. And I intend on getting a carbon fiber hood for this, which they recommend having hood pins for it. So, if you install on a nice Mustang, essentially that's garage kept, uh, you should definitely put down some painter's tape to cover the area so that way you don't scratch anything. I'm not scratching anything doing this without it. However, if something did happen, I'm not as concerned as most other people would for this is actually a practice run before I get the carbon fiber hood and that is definitely something that I don't want to end up messing up. So if there was a time for me to mess up, I would rather it be now. Okay. So that has a lot of clearance. So we can actually take this pin down farther and we're going to have to turn it a little bit to the side. Okay, so you're gonna take your eight millimeter socket and take this front portion here off. All right, now we're gonna take our cord. We're gonna fish it through right up here and it's basically a perfect fit
Okay, so now we're gonna take this, do a test fit. Now, we're gonna have to draw out this portion right here. And there we go. If you have hardware, this is where you would go ahead and reinstall it. Now that's the only thing that's a pain if you have that. You're going to have to watch putting that down. Everything seems good. Snapping that on. Bang. Okay guys, and just like that, your Mustang now has hood pins. Now, I'm sure I'm gonna get a lot of backlash on the fact that this thing is dirty and that my install was a little bit messy. But again, like I said, you can see I've got some damage there and some damage in a few other spots. There's actually a dent up here somewhere, if I can find it. I actually might have put the hood pin right on the dent that I had, which would be pretty cool. Yeah, I think I did. <laughs> that worked out. But anyway, so, like I said, mine is a show car, but it's not a show car. It's not garage kept. It's a daily driver, so it's expected to be dirty. So, hopefully you guys will at least appreciate this video instead of bashing everything about it. But yeah. So that's a 2015 through 2017 Mustang hood pin install. The apocalypse.